So what's good, TMG fam? It's your boy L, and I'm back with another reaction. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel, man. Salute. So listen, I'm up, right? I'm up, hop up today. You know, getting ready for the day. Monday, let's get going. I'm scrolling down my timeline, and I'm seeing all these people snowed in. Like, a lot of people caught snow. Got that snow going on. You know what I mean? So, listen, bro, I... I'm just gonna, hey, hey, I'm just gonna send up some prayers up for you. That's all. You know what I mean? I'm sending some prayers up for you. I'm here. I got you covered. I got you a video. You know what I mean? Just don't send it my way. That's that's the only thing I'm asking, bro. Because they told us last night we was worried because we got some rain in, and they was like, after the rain, it's gonna be possible chance of snow. And I was like, <sighs> woke up this morning, didn't see snow, was extra hype. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Extra, I just gave myself the hiccups. Extra hype. So, but I got y'all who snowed in that need something, that need a vid, need something to watch. I got y'all. You know I got y'all. So we're going to check out creepy footage that will keep you awake tonight. All right? Keep you awake tonight. And I might just add on the end of that title, keep you awake and warm tonight. All right? So we're going to check this video out. If you're new to the channel, man, hit that subscribe button, bro. What you doing in 2022? Hit that subscribe button. Join the fam. And, um... Let's check this video out. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some scary videos no one can quite explain. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more mysterious content. Just like this. In March 2010, Annie Bennett uploaded some eerie videos to her YouTube account that are anything but normal. When the couple in the video moved into their new home, they weren't expecting anything out of the ordinary to happen. However, when they started to hear strange things happening in the vicinity of their piano late at night, usually between 2.15 and 2.30 a.m. Like, I don't think nobody when they move into their new home is expecting anything paranormal, or else you probably wouldn't have moved there, right? You know what I mean? It's, it's a few that would still do it, but for the most part, most of us ain't moving into a home if we know it's paranormal. So that statement in the beginning was funny to me. Hold on, I'll let y'all hear it again. 2010, Annie Bennett uploaded some eerie videos to her YouTube account that are anything but normal. When the couple in the video moved into their new home, they weren't expecting anything out of the ordinary to happen. However, when they started to hear strange things happening in the vicinity of their piano late at night, usually between 2.15 and 2.30 a.m., they started to get concerned. In their first video, we see why. Take a look. As you can see, the cover on the clock on top of the piano suddenly flings itself open, even though there's clearly no one around that could have done it. Okay, that's, get a that's not too, too bad, but I'm definitely on alert now. I see something like that happen. That, that, that ain't gonna make me run for the hills, but I'm definitely on alert. Even weirder in the second video. Once again, they focus the camera on the piano, and once again, the cover of the clock opens all on its own. However, the ghostly activity doesn't end there. A few minutes later, this happens. It's subtle, but watching that again, a piano key is pressed down by some kind of invisible force. A single eerie note floats into the air. I'm a little bit more alarmed at this point, but not too, too, because something could be in there. You don't know. You might have a rodent, something got inside of your piano, or maybe those is one of those pianos that like self play itself, like play it by itself. Maybe it's that. So I'm really on alert now. You know what I mean? Not high alert, but not low alert either. I'm in, I'm somewhere in the middle right now. A few minutes later, more activity is captured. 
All right, at this point, I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm I'm done. I gave it. I gave it the old three college tries. I'm out. I don't like it. Nope. I don't like it. Mm -mm. Despite the keys being covered, we can now hear more quiet notes being played. The video ends with one final piece of eerie movement. Oh, did it close back? According to the homeowners, they've been told that the previous occupant died in the house shortly before they moved in. Could her spirit still be lingering there? According to some paranormal experts, for a spirit to move objects in the physical world, it requires significant strength. So a recently deceased individual would be a likely culprit for such activity. No matter who or what the culprit is, this is definitely some spooky activity. That don't even look kind of like their furniture. You think they kept the furniture from the previous tenant? I'm not saying it's not theirs, it just doesn't look like it fit them. You know what I mean? The old school clock, the old school piano, these glasses look kind of old schoolish. So just assessing what I'm seeing. Yeah, yeah, I'm out. I'm gone. Doorbell cameras are a great way to keep your home safe. However, many users, such as TikToker Amanda Lloyd7, are starting to discover that the footage from these cameras often shows more than you bargain for. This footage is recorded in the bright light of a windy day. It seems that the motion of a door swinging in the wind triggered the camera to begin recording. As the camera rolls, something begins to move in the camera's line of sight. Like multiple things. As you can see, a strange shadowy figure seems to emerge from behind the fence. It dashes back and forth across the yard, then disappears behind the fence once again. What could this strange figure be? Its dark, shadowy appearance would suggest that it might be a shadow person a type of spirit often described as a walking shadow. However, shadow people are usually elusive, only spotted in the dark of night in fleeting glances that make you wonder if you're actually seeing anything at all. It seems highly unlikely that a shadow person would stop and wave at a rolling camera. Some viewers think it's just some debris being tossed about in the heavy wind, which Maybe. is certainly a possibility but there's something just so strange about the way the shadowy object moves. Like, are my eyes deceiving me or did I see more than one shadowy thing moving in the distance? And the other ones look kind of like moved at a speed of like a dog, in a sense. I don't know, it was weird. So what do you think's been captured here? Share your take with the community in the comments section down below. I don't know, but I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> when TikToker Andrea M. Kuhn sadly lost their grandmother, the last thing they were thinking about were ghosts, at least until they saw this clip. The TikToker's cousin's son took out their camera to record their younger brother playing with a toy gun. Neither seems to notice anything strange while they're recording the video. However, the footage clearly shows something odd. Watch. A shadow seems to pass directly in front of the camera. It seems impossible that anything corporeal could have passed so closely in front of the camera, directly in between the person filming and the little boy without either of them noticing. 
Clearly, whatever caused the shadow was invisible to the naked eye, only appearing on film. That was a huge shadow. Because of the recent death of a beloved family member, the TikToker is inclined to believe that the shadow shows evidence that their grandmother's spirit had stopped by for one last visit. Do you agree? Let us know down below. The little kid act like he felt something. He might not have seen it, but he felt something. Look at his response. Let us know down below. He quickly turned to look to see like, what was that? Like, y'all, y'all feel that? As most parents will tell you, it's important to capture photos of precious memories with your children. However, if they're anything like this photo shared to Reddit by Armorino817, you may see something you'd rather forget. When her daughter started tottering around the living room in two big sneakers, this mother grabbed a camera to capture the moment. However, when they looked at the photo later, it was something in the background that captured their attention. If you look closely, there appears to be something sitting at the kitchen table, though only their head is visible. With either white eyes or they're wearing glasses. Now, I don't know if your vision don't get, get fixed in the afterlife, but this person is, either has like some all white or they're wearing glasses. Not sure. According to the woman who took the photo, she and See? You can see it even more now. Her daughter were all alone in the house when the photo was taken. To make matters even creepier, a close inspection of the image shows that the eyes of the mysterious face appear to be glowing. Yeah. Some skeptics on Reddit believe that it's not actually a face that we're seeing, but rather a cat perched atop the table. A Others are certain that- A cat? No. Whatever it is, I would be extra nervous because now it's like it's staring, like it staring at my child, like it wants my child, it's waiting on the right opportunity to pounce on my child so yeah we we have to do something about it. we yeah we got to make a move that it looks exactly like a human face if it is a face who does it belong to who was watching the mother and her child when they thought they were alone whether human or paranormal this mysterious face is certainly haunting is anybody like is anybody trying to look like under the table to see if y'all see like legs or feet This TikTok by Lopez1616 has left a lot of viewers scratching their heads. The video shows a parking area sometime after dark. There's a person and a few dogs moving around in the foreground of the video. With all this movement, you may miss something strange happening in the background. Watch closely for a figure moving between the two trucks in the upper right hand corner of the screen. If you watch its movements again closely, it seems to appear out of nowhere. It walks a few steps, then disappears. It definitely came out of nowhere. Some viewers think that the shadow's sudden appearance and disappearance could be explained by a camera glitch, or even a reflection from the person's high-vis vest that's walking by. But it looked like the person got into the... Am I tripping? It, it, doesn't that look like the person got into the vehicle? But it, it don't look like a door opened or anything. Pay attention to the side mirror. It don't move. It didn't move on that black vehicle. With the limited information that we have available, it's hard to make a call either way. So I'll throw this out to you, the viewers. What do you think's going on in this mysterious piece of footage? I tell you what, I'd be getting some new dogs if they ain't alert me to that back there. <laughs> nah, nah, you got to alert me. You got to do your job. Strange creatures aren't all that shocking for Erwin Saunders, an explorer who searches for the strange and unusual. In this video, he takes us along on one of his adventures. I'm still, what I'm trying to do is just still locate this, this, um, you know, little chat. Saunders often explores spots deep in the woods searching for creatures that most people never get to see. 
Then he creates beautiful drawings of them. In this video, he spots a small creature through the thick foliage and manages to record it for a few seconds. He's just up there. He doesn't know I'm watching him by the looks of it. I'm not sure what he's doing. Look at that tree. Oh, he spotted me. Okay, I better get back down. It appears to be very thin and only a few feet in height. It has dark skin and seems to be wearing a tall, spiked headdress. Saunders is unable to get close enough to record its facial features before a noise scares it away. <laughs> I don't think you need to get no closer. We could all tell that's not human. Oh, you spotted me. Okay, I better get back down. Most viewers think that the creature is most likely some sort of fairy or sprite, diminutive creatures often talked about in the folklore of various countries around the world. Many cultures believe in the existence of the Fae and take steps to avoid angering them. Does this footage really show some sort of mythical fairy, or is it something else entirely? Either way, Irwin's art is well worth checking out. I'll put a link to his work in the description box below. It's full of all sorts of fun and whimsical creatures. He spotted me. Okay, I better get back down. Before we take a look at some freaky footage captured by a CCTV camera in a restaurant, remember to hit that subscribe button, then tickle that little bell icon there. Wee wee, and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary and mysterious videos. When TikToker Tay Chibs visited a supposedly haunted restaurant for dinner, she was skeptical about the paranormal claims. However, she soon became a believer. The security camera at the restaurant managed to capture her strange experience. We see a waitress place a drink on the table when something strange happens. Watch. The glass begins spinning and moving across the table. A few seconds later, it stops of its own accord. She grabs the glass and moves it slightly. According to the TikToker, they spent the rest of the dinner trying to replicate the strange movement, thinking that expanding condensation or a slanted table could have made the glass move. However, they couldn't replicate the strange movement. Yeah, that wasn't like a slide to to a certain direction, just one way. No, it kind of circled around, <laughs> did something great. No, no, I wouldn't even eat there no more. According to the TikToker, her dinner companion had been playing around with his glass in a similar fashion, spinning it around on the table. The OP wondered if a spirit had been trying to copy him. Given that the restaurant has a reputation for... If the spirit is doing that, then spirits are bored. I'm convinced. Uh, you can't convince me otherwise. They bored. They ain't got nothing to do. <laughs> Being haunted, it's certainly eerie to see the glass move in such a strange way. Now, if you want some more scary... Now, what's crazy about that is like, what did they actually... Where, how did they get the footage? What did they go and ask the restaurant? Listen, we need a copy of that 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 tape we need to see what just happened like or did they have a hidden camera like i have so many questions for that last video bro make that one make sense to me because that's not a normal like condensation move of a glass anything i've ever seen it moves like one direction not no circular but she said he was doing it earlier so you think it followed the path of it i don't know i don't think a paranormal spirit or demon or whatever is is just sitting there mimicking dude. I, I don't think so. But I could be wrong, man. So listen, but y'all get at me in the comment section. Let me know what you think. Um, creepy footage that will keep you awake tonight. And um, y'all stay warm. Stay safe out there in that snow. You know what I mean? If you ain't got to go nowhere, don't go. Just chill. I'll be back with something else for you. I got you. It's your boy L. To the next reaction, I'm gone. Peace.